collapses unfolding on every imaginable front. How bad is it? Answer, it's far worse than almost any are willing to contemplate. Here's a snapshot update of only one piece of the puzzle. One piece that in and of itself is a looming, extremely near-term existential threat. I've just had an update communication from a former NASA contract engineer that has been taking UV radiation readings for geoengineeringwatch.org. Geoengineering Watch supplied the -the state-of-the-art metering equipment for this ongoing UV monitoring. The latest news is far beyond bleak. Here's the statement just received from the former NASA contract engineer, quote, In regard to solar spectral radiometry measurements that I've taken over the last five years, the relative increase in UVB and UVC levels over just the past year should alarm and horrify everyone. He continues, this is a summary of UVC and UVB solar spectral radiation data taken from February 4th, 2021. February 4th, 2021, clear sky data measurements. As compared to data gathered a year ago in February of 2020, UVC levels are nearly 150% higher and UVB levels are greater than 200% higher. Conclusion. This is his statement, word for word. If the current measurements continue to increase at this rate, it's a lights out scenario for all plant and animal life on our precious earth. The trend analysis I performed on data in 2016 indicated that if unchecked, the UV levels would be so high by 2025 that we would no longer be able to grow crops in direct sunlight. Unfortunately, that trend analysis was conservative as compared to the data recently acquired. At this point, I hesitate to even state the current trend or give a new timeline. All I can say on a personal level is thank you to all my friends and family who have helped me with the research I have accomplished thus far, because we may not be here on this wonderful planet for much longer. The former NASA contract engineer finishes with this. In the interest of all life on planet Earth, stop all geoengineering programs now while you still can. End of his statement. This is one piece of the puzzle, one of the converging catastrophes that are closing in on us all.